God, me, I promise. You could be there, you are the day. Welcome to this episode of Yaw of Day. My name is Kuji Shout in the head is big for a reason. You can listen to the Yaw of the Day show on 321 for free. If you're a Vodafone user, that 321 follow the voice prompt and listen to the Yaw of the Day show for free. Like you did somewhere where internet no day for you to watch me on YouTube. You can still dial 321 and listen to the Yaw of the Day audio. And so look sharp. Vodafone users on. Now, this issue that they come talk about, I need honest opinions from you people that have that have done it before. Because me personally, my whole life, I have never done it before. I haven't been into that thing before since I came out from one. In the wise words of J. Cole. I can't use the word because kiddies they watch me. So yes. I haven't been uh, I haven't been in one since I came out from one. So yes, that is basically it. So I would need you people to be honest with me because this, this has generated a whole lot of conversations on Twitter. It has been, uh, it has been retweeted by uh, I think 11,000 plus people, quoted uh, by 8,000 plus people and liked by 138,000 people. So it should tell you how thought provoking and, and, and controversial this, this particular content I'm coming to talk about is. So please, let us all respect ourselves. I know some of you have done it before. Even right now, as you do watch me, you are doing it. There is not, I mean, I'm not judging you, bro. Just be you and do you, bro. By judgment, they will all go meet for them. They will go project your own for them. <laughs> uh, I'm judgment day. It will be like hour of the day, replay of the hour of the day. Anyway, now listen to me. This is the story. This is the premise of the conversation we are going to have. Someone posted um, an account, Vibes and Cuddles, posted this. Cuddles before and after sex. So your man, yeah, like the, 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 the tweet is basically soliciting um, people that might take on this particular thing. So like Cuddles before and after sex. That is what your man put out there. And he's soliciting for what? Uh, opinions or, you know, whatnot from people. And here be the comments where you go carry all this matter in. All these issues come. Now, here be somebody in reply. If only you understand how your man sees you after sex, you will not talk about cuddles. He proceeded. Guys, even if you love her, it takes hours to see the beauty in her again after sex, after having sex. Then someone came to reply. Straight facts. Straight facts right here, homie. I feel like an animal after sex. Uh, can't look at my girl the same way. Got alleged... Uh, not even look at her for at least a couple of hours. Thought this was just a me kind of thing. Then the guy replied again, the feelings is mutual. I need hours to look at her properly again. Is that what you people are going through? So after sex, ha, hey, so listen to what the guy said. Straight facts right here, homie. I feel like an animal after sex. After sex, Can't look at my girl the same way. Got alleged to not even look at her for at least a couple of hours. Thought this was just me, was, was just me kind of thing. Where your man can reply, say, the feeling is mutual. I need hours to look at her properly. E, is that what you people are going through? So after you are done, based on the conversation that is happening, after you are done having sex, you people, they see your woman in some light or what? Me, mom, me personally, I've never had sex before, so I, I can't relate to this. And I go feel hold my head, then we could care self. Where I'll be fine. So I can't relate to this conversation. But is that what you people go through? Somebody is saying, say, after I said, you they see, you they feel like you be animal. I then. So like you you do pine, 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 pine. Sex rounds finish. Then you they see a woman like you be chubbox. <laughs> or you be piece of wood. Or it be bread, or it be something. Then, like some few hours later, in beauty will come back. Is that what you people feel? Because I, I, when you go through the comments, it's like people are sharing same like opinions, and it is mostly coming from the guys. Then you, really, I feel like they, if they, if that be hard, then you know they like your woman. Like, ah, nah, this is weird, psychologically weird. You understand? I don't know, but nah. I'll be after sex you for like you know after sex you go be uh, what are we then you say <laughs> we are nothing but pencils in the uh, in the hands of the creator or in the eyes of the creator. Once again, people share their story with me. I don't know what you people are talking about. 
But let me read some of the comments to you. It's crazy. This one said, men like that need a, men like that need to realize that post post not clarity shit is due to insecurities, shame, and guilt. If you have a healthy sex love life, that shit doesn't actually happen. Only motherfuckers with issues have post not clarity. So that issue, that particular thing where they happen after sex, they call it post not clarity. As as at two when you saw, that is what they are saying. And this I say, when you view sex as inherently degrading for women, then this is the result. Then this one say, after sex, all I want to do is cuddle face to face and share in the beauty of the person that trusts me enough to be intimate in that way. I cannot fathom how uh, fucked up uh, this view of sex and women is. And they got, oh boss, and I mean, I mean to me already. Okay. So your man is basic. I mean, after sex, after sex, you're supposed to look at your woman. What a beautiful woman. You have trusted me. You have ah, like you have trusted me to this point of getting intimate with me. You are supposed to cuddle. You are supposed to lock legs. Please, this is for married people only. And for Jimmy and my fornication on the comment section. And yes, I don't know how you no, it'd be crazy. Like I said, this has been quoted by eight thousand plus people, and it'd be crazy. This one said after after says. I just feel guilty. I just feel guilty with the feeling of I did I did that to her. What did you do to her? You may put that to yourself. After sex, I just feel guilty with the feeling of I did that to her. Okay. Charlie. And it goes on and on. I say, I seen shit like this before on TikTok. Uh asked uh, my man about it, and he told me he's never heard anything more incorrect in his life. Maybe he was telling me what I wanted to hear, but he said it genuine as fact. So do with what you will. Oh, okay, okay, whatever it is. Okay, so yes, that is basically the conversation. But I, I want to understand why you go share intimate something with something, somebody. Then after that, it's like, yeah, you they see the person some way. Be. It doesn't make, you know, you know, it makes sense to me. Like, for example, you and your wife. You and your wife, you've, you've married for let's say five years. You, you, then you, then your wife. The any time be you, then your wife go have sex. You know, after the sex, you know, like it go take some hours for you to like see your wife as your wife. Be like as in that time frame, now within that time frame, there you be like it be some laptop battery or something. You know, they, you know, they make sense. Oh. No, honestly. So if we're a guy and you they do that, you they, because I ah, know, bro, me, I can't wait to do it though, but until I get married, you understand? I can't wait to do it when I get married. After that, I, oh, baby girl, do you want breakfast in bed or supper in the dining hall? Whatever you want, bills on me, everything on me. That big, <laughs> yes, because this is your wife. How are you seeing her in a different light? I, how it tear your eyes stop? So I want to understand from you people for make I understand. Do some of you go through some of these things? Please, here is a safe place, but we'll use it for content. Yes. So I want you to, people to tell me, is that how you people see that thing? Because it'd be weird to me, honestly. It, I, it is weird to me, bro. This one said, I am grateful for being a lesbian every day. But especially today, thank you, Jesus. Now, the person who even posted this thing, this is the caption, I will never touch a man again for as long as I live. Look at how my gender is converting innocent girls into <laughs> lesbian. Oh, oh. Hey. Nah, this is weird, bro. I don't know, man. But I want, this one is like a conversation. I want to understand. I want to, let me know what you think about this. If you have experienced it before, as I said, here is a safe place. Drop it in the comment section. Because honestly, this, 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 this ain't right to me. Say you, then your wife or your girlfriend, where you be put a date or you marry after the sex, you know, then like within a time frame, you go see him and say you be good, like, yeah, who you and be intense. Then later on, the thing will come back again. Weird to me, honestly. It's weird. But let me know what you think in the comment section. Once again, my gender will disgrace you, bro. Look at the conversation that they have. Someone say after sexy, they feel like an animal. I know you're a werewolf. 
Wolverine cramp will have a sex. Oh. <laughs> yeah, blow. Now, Mr. Judgment Day, dear. Mom, Kwasu. Me, mom, dear. I can't relate. I don't know what this is about. But I can't wait to experience it. Not this, though. I can't wait to experience the beauty of sex when I get married, eventually. Fadi Bonku, Fadi Bonku, you get married uh, eventually. But right now, I just, will you people that you are experienced in the field of operation, you know, let me know what you think. You understand? Because me, dear, I don't know, man. But I want to know. What do you think? Have you experienced it before? Drop it in the comment section. My name is Kudya Sheldon. See you on the flip side of things. Peace.